The King of Comedy is a comedy film produced by Xinhui Overseas Company, directed by Li Lichi and Zhou Xingqi, starring Zhou Xingqi, Mo Wenwei, and Zhang Bozhi. The film was released in Hong Kong on February 13, 1999. The King of Comedy is a masterpiece of Zhou Xingqi's acting career. Especially the first hour, which was almost perfect. It is said that "You Laugh and Then Cry" is the highest state of comedy, and the king of comedy has done it. In Tianchou, he's an anachronistic person. His biggest problem is that he takes acting too seriously. He was often dissatisfied by the scribbles of his colleagues, and pretends to be a director. Among these runners. Only Yin Tianchou wears a suit and tie, which shows that his meticulous attitude. At the same time, this is a kind of psychological hint of himself. He has no qualifications, no contacts, and he must work hard. He needs this suit to keep himself confident and helpful. Even if he's illusory for the time being, it is better than nothing at all. Then he got a chance to act as extras. Before shooting, he asked the director what character the role was. After analyzing a lot of things, he was shot in the first second of shooting. When Du Juan Er made her final appearance, Yin Tianchou suddenly stood up, which made the entire crew wasting time. His reason was that his role was should be a little bit naughty, and he was fired in the end. The above scenes portray the personality of his character. First of all, Yin Tianchou has been a renunciation and wanted to be an actor because he seemed to be very ignorant of the rules on set. He created his own character without authorization. He does not consider the hard work of other stuff. His theories are all copied from books, and there is not much practice. He can't even act to be shot correctly. In Tianchou's setting, is not to be unsuccessful, but a rookie whose theory is greater than practice. When he was humiliated by the uncle who delivered unboxed lunches at the door of the crew, the director used a handheld camera to follow In Tianchou, which shows that the changes in In Tianchou's facial expression in a delicate manner. See, you are one. 读诗，并非我一面意。我则。尹天仇 returned to the neighborhood welfare association. This is his real job, and he faces retired old people and children every day. The room where he lives can be said to be very poor. Only the posters of the film stars on the walls remind him of his dreams. Well, he couldn't stand it. He could only read a masterpiece called *The Self-Cultivation of an Actor* repeatedly. Every time when this book appears in the film, there will be a big turning point in the movie. In Tianchou decided to stop thinking nonsense. Since no one wants him to act, he will act on his own. He started with the classic *Thunderstorm*, but couldn't find audience to watch his performance. At this time, the director used a similar object for transition. That is the commercial poster with the words "I'm a shit." When the shot was changed to a wide shot, the heroine Liu Piao Piao appeared on the stage. She's a young lady dancing in a nightclub. She doesn't have a high EQ, so she doesn't know how to act on the spot. Her boss heard that Yin Tianchou teaches acting for free, and she asked the lady who are not good at acting to join the class. In the class of acting, every time when Liu Piao Piao said that Yin Tianchou was an extra, he emphasized that he was an actor. Yin Tianchou mistakenly hurts Liu Piao Piao's self-esteem by saying a wrong sentence, so he was beaten by her. The two people are in the same status. The extra wants to be a real actor, and the lady in the nightclub wants real love. When Liu Piao Piao returned to the nightclub. And found that intangible skills were very useful. She decided to formally learn from him. 
Intentional's professional knowledge finally has time to play. The director here used close-up focus over, over the shoulder to show Intentional and Liu Piao Piao's faces, which shows that they have become close. Finally, the dolly shots pushes in, which made the audience feel that there will be a story happening between these two young people. However, when Intentional returned to the set, he was once again humiliated by the uncle. Although his career has been hard, he has made progress in his love. When he was acting on the stage in the community, Liu Piao Piao suddenly appeared in the audience. Here, the director used exciting soundtracks and zoom out shots to portray their happy emotions. They had sex that night. When they woke up in the morning, Yin Tianchou looked at the Liu Piao Piao. He didn't know whether this was real love or consumption, so he took out all his money as overnight expenses. Piao Piao picked up the money and said, Thank you, boss. The design of these shots is wonderful. The director used over the shoulder to let the audience see the peeping perspective, which accurately conveyed Yin Tianchou's ambivalence. The next scene can be said to be classic confession in the film history. Intentional shots has been reversed 118 degrees, which proves that he really fell in love with Liu Piao Piao. The camera zooms in from the wide shot to Liu Piao Piao, giving the audience a sense of shock. This proved that Liu Piao Piao was also moved, but she did not want to say it. At this time, Intentional was valued by the superstar Du Juan Er, and he contributed an impressive performance. Du Jun Er was conquered by Intentional's performance and wanted him to be the leading actor. Intentional's persistence finally paid off. At the same time, Liu Piao Piao, who works in a nightclub, ignited hope for love because of Intentional's words. She refused to sleep with the guest and was beaten. When she went back to find Intentional again, she learned that he had become the hero of the film. She returned the book to Intentional. The shot in Zion at this time is very clever. The shots are all over the shoulder, and neither of the two characters show their faces, and they both lock part of each other. This explains the contradiction in the characters' hearts, and that they don't know what to do. At the end of the film, In Tian Chou still failed to become the protagonist, but to be a helper for the police. This ending is somewhat bizarre. Hegel once proposed a drama theory, the protagonist of a comedy chooses to live in his home world in order to achieve harmony between himself and the outside world. The values he insisted on often conflict with the outside world, and there will be a lot of comedy plots. The character in Tian Chou fits this theory perfectly, and acting is his belief. In the eyes of most people, this belief is ridiculous. He insists that he is an actor, but in the eyes of outsiders, he's just a fool. If courage cannot defeat the outside world, 
I saw the loneliness and helplessness of life from his comedy, and I was moved by Intentional's persistence. We are all assigned one or more roles in our lives father, mother, son, daughter, employees, and boss. It doesn't matter how big or small the role is, as long as it is performed seriously, it will be brilliant. As the famous saying goes, there are only small actors, no small roles. Intentional always had a positive attitude towards his life and work, and all he saw was sunshine. Wait, that's a man, Gay Guy Han. What do I know? Don't mind, yeah. Tingong Jiao Jiao will.